this video is for uh, the lighting design for street lighting so whenever you will uh, open that dialog CVO oh, then uh, this screen will appear this is dialog CVO 10.1 version and we want to uh, design the street light so click here okay now as you can see uh, this is the uh, screen uh, splitted into three parts this is uh, part one this is second part and this one is the third part so in the third part uh, it will be displayed that layout layout drawing 2d and 3d view this is 2d and this is 3d in 3d nothing is there only a simple road 2d also okay and in the left hand side this is under planning under planning this is the site plan construction so in this part i will uh, describe how to uh, how to define the uh, construction uh, related uh, values over here suppose uh, uh, how to design this uh, street light uh, whether it is uh, one lane or two lanes whether there is uh, walkways so all these things i will discuss about uh, all these things in this video so let's start uh, first of all let's uh, create a, a name name here suppose this is uh, lake road okay now this is active road and here uh, this is the street profile so one roadway is already inserted so you can see this uh, this is the one roadway if I want to if I want to add another roadway let's go to 3d view and you can adjust this screen okay so this is our 3d view let's add uh, another roadway simply click here add a roadway now see this is roadway 2 so in the 3d view also roadway 1 roadway 2 okay suppose uh, these are number of lanes so number of lanes it is 2 if it is uh, 1 if I change to one then you can see this is uh, lane number is one let's keep it two only okay now uh, this is the roadway width this is uh, seven meter so this is for roadway one so it is seven meter so you can customize uh, any value suppose 8 meter so it is now wider let's go back to 7 meter because this is very standard outside but you can customize always and this click here for roadway 2 this is for roadway 2 here also the same thing roadway width you can change number of lanes you can change okay one thing we can uh, rename also for this roadway suppose this is uh, lake north okay and this is lake south okay 
and here there is another uh, tab over here this is valuation field this is uh, name you see this is north this is south so here you can see uh, this is the illuminance class so based on this it is by default this is m4 you can change to any of the values whenever uh, you can see whenever you are changing here this uh, these these particulars these details are also being uh, cha changed here it will also change yeah like north m4 so this will also change and this uh, right hand side this data will come only after the uh, illumination uh, calculation these values will come so for the time being it is blank okay now let's uh, complete our construction part so we uh, as of now we have added two numbers uh, for roadways uh, like north and like south suppose we want to provide one divider or one median in between these two roads so click here now select this one and you can move up or down using this arrow so if i select here and click this down arrow that means once one 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 side uh, down here so in between north and south there is one median so in the 3d view also you can see this middle size this one okay now you can you can uh, change the parameters uh, here for this median suppose the, uh, the, this is uh, one meter you can, you can change you can change this uh, value also this height also uh, so these two parameters you can customize okay uh, next uh, let's uh, add add sidewalk this is for sidewalk so just click here then this out sidewalk this is added here you can see this is added here okay sidewalk uh, one and uh, let's add another one this is two so this is at the same side so we need to move this we need to move this down okay further down okay now it is you can see this side this is uh, this is uh, sidewalk one this is sidewalk two yeah okay and for this sidewalk you can uh, rename also uh, you can change the width width of the sidewalk suppose this is 2.2.5 meter or 3 meter height 0.1 meter you can change also and for this sidewalk to the same value i'll put here 2.5 meter okay okay now uh, at bicycle lane you can add uh, levi's and here so this is for grass uh, grass strip if you want to add okay so it will look look good uh, suppose this uh, another another one so i want to add at uh, both side move it down down further down further down okay now as you can see here these are the main uh, roadways and, uh, and this is uh, walkways and this is grass uh, scenery along the road side okay so now this is construction part and here also you can change this uh, width width also you can change suppose this is 3 meter 4 meter is uh, too much okay 3 meter and for this strip 2 let's change this 3 meter okay now let's go back to 2d view 
okay as you can see uh, this is the 2d view and we can measure also this total this total width now 26 26 meter 26 meter okay so uh, this is the uh, construction part mm, I have added and these values here you can see this is for North Lake uh, data these are the defined values and this will be your calculated value after performing the calculation this is for Lake, uh, Lake South Road this is for sidewalk 1 this is for sidewalk 2 so after uh, running the calculation this data will come that time we will see we will see in the next video